Yeah. Lynn told me that I've been here so often that I have earned a sweatshirt. Yes. So I'm looking for my sweatshirt. So if anybody has my, never mind, she left it at home. But in any case, I just want to. <laughs> uh, well, hopefully I'll come out even after I'm uh, no longer in office. As you may know, I am termed out. I see somebody applauding already because I'm termed out. No, they're not really, not, not really Tiger Jazz, huh? I, I just wanted to say that it, this is a little smaller than it used to be, but it used to be a really bigger, much bigger event. We should take much more of a park, I guess, over there. And this is smaller, um, which is fine, but, you know, it's because... We've had COVID the last couple of years, and I think that kind of uh, really stopped us from being much more active. But one of the things that has never stopped, nothing has ever stopped Lynn Adams. And she has done such a remarkable job in Pacifica with the Pacifica Beach Coalition, which has now changed. It's much more, has a broader uh, reach and scope than it had before. But I just want to thank her and also thank the citizens of uh, Pacifica. You're the largest city in my district. And, um, I, you know, I, I love all the cities. Every single one of them is unique in its own way. But one of the things that is so unique about Pacifica, especially when you drive in, in this area and you look at that ocean and all the people who are enjoying and the people who are walking on the trails, this has got to be the healthiest city in my, maybe in, in San Mateo County. The people are just uh, always out about walking around, enjoying the ocean, enjoying the ocean breeze. So with that, um, I've been proud to be representative of this community, and it's been an honor of a lifetime, and I thank all of you, even if you didn't vote for me. So in any case, thanks very much.